Buzz Beaker in the Race to School, written by Car Carrie Meister and illustrated by Bill McGuire. It was dark. The Beaker home was quiet. Everyone was sleeping except Buzz. Buzz loved the early hours of the morning. It was his best time to invent. Buzz put on his goggles. He put on his gloves. Let's see how my formula is doing, Buzz whispered. His dog, Rags, was also asleep. Buzz poured green goo into a jar. He added some liquid. Then he stirred them together with a glass rod. Buzz frowned. It's not quite right, he said. Buzz mixed and mixed. He was so busy he didn't notice the sun come up. He didn't hear his alarm clock. Buzz, you're gonna be late, yelled Larry. Buzz looked at his watch. Oh no, he yelled. Buzz grabbed his backpack. He jumped out the window, but he missed the bus. Buzz ran all the way to school. He was late. Early the next morning, Buzz was working again. I have to figure this out, he said to the sleeping rags. Buzz measured and poured. Buzz mixed and stirred. Buzz didn't see the sun. He didn't hear his alarm clock. Buzz didn't notice the school bus. Buzz, yelled Larry, you're gonna be late. Buzz looked at his watch. Not again, he said. Buzz grabbed his backpack and jumped out the window. Buzz ran fast, but he was late again. Buzz walked into class. Everybody was laughing. What's so funny? asked Buzz. I think you forgot something, said Sarah. Buzz looked down. He could not believe it. He was still wearing his pajamas. After school, Buzz put on some clothes. I can't be late for school again, he told Rags. I must think of something. Buzz dug in his backpack. He got out his notebook and started planning. It will take two inventions, but I know what to do, Buzz said. Buzz found a hammer, a saw, and a bell. Then he found a very long piece of rope. Buzz worked until dinner. There, he said, I'll never be late for school again. Early the next morning, Buzz was busy mixing. He was busy pouring and stirring. He did not notice the sun. He did not hear his alarm clock. But he did hear the bell ring. My invention worked, said Buzz. Now it's time to get to school. Buzz changed his clothes and jumped out the window. Buzz missed the bus, but that did not bother him. Today, he was not gonna be late. Now it's time for my other invention, said Buzz. He grabbed a hang handle hanging from the tree. He got a running start. Whee! he yelled. Buzz rode all the way to school. He was not late. He even beat the bus. The end. Hope you enjoy, readers. See you next time.